Hello and welcome to my channel, Geminis. Thank you once again for joining me today. The reading that I'll be doing today is a little bit different. It's going to be addressing four card decks, the first of which is Healing with the Angels, followed by Messages from the Angels, followed by Angel Answers, and then ultimately we're going to have a Law of Attraction card that will focus on what it is that uh, you can do to manifest things in your life at this time, okay? This is a general reading not meant to resonate with everyone, so please pick from it um, what does resonate with you. And also I wanted to bring to your attention, guys, I do have a new reading that I added onto my website. It's called The Love Triangle, and it's a great reading if you are contemplating a relationship between two individuals, two separate romantic prospects. It will really offer you insight in regard to which person is best suited for you. All right, so that is now on the website. And as always, if you'd like a personal reading, please uh, access that information down below. All right, Gemini, so let's go ahead and get started. I went ahead and I pre-shuffled the card, so we're ready to go. The first card that will be coming forth is a healing card. So let's see what it is that you need to heal from at this time. Okay, Geminis? All right. So right now, the retreat card, excuse me, is coming forward. So I'm feeling for some of you, Geminis, that you've just been working nonstop for such a long time that you haven't taken the time to give yourself the rest and rejuvenation that you really truly need physically, mentally, spiritually, and emotionally. You, I'm feeling for some of you Geminis, you're just drained and you've just been going nonstop, whether it be by way of too much work or if you've been in a challenging relationship, whatever the case may be, I'm feeling that some of you guys are just exhausted and you need to retreat and rest and kind of regroup and figure things out in order to move forward in a more rested state to where you can make better decisions in your life. So definitely take the time to take care of yourself. Take time to pamper yourself and put yourself first for once, okay? Sometimes we're so busy taking care of everybody else that you kind of forget about yourself. So yes, Gemini, definitely take care of yourself and take the time to get that rest, that much needed rest. Okay, so messages from the angels. Let's see what message comes through for you at this time. Okay, we've got Angel Shanti, and her card states, I am the angel of peace. I bring you new tranquility and a smoother road ahead. So this is affirming for some of you Geminis that you've been through a rough patch. Life hasn't been easy. And Angel Shanti is now telling you that She's restoring peace in your life. She's bringing back tranquility and a smoother road ahead for you. So whatever issues you guys have been dealing with in your life, um, whatever chaos has been coming into your life in whatever fashion it may be coming in, whether it's relationships, the lack of money, or challenges at work, or other situations that you've been dealing with, Whatever the case may be, you're now heading into a more peaceful time in your life. All right, Geminis? So the next card will be addressing the answer to a question that's been weighing heavily for some of you guys. You've been waiting for an answer to a question that you've had. And you've been asking for some sort of sign, some sort of affirmation in order to proceed in regards to the issue that you've been thinking about. So this next card will address that answer. Okay, the answer is abundance. How awesome is that? So for some of you Geminis, I'm feeling that this is in relation to career and in relation to money matters. And this is affirming that you are heading into a place of abundance heading into the future that times will get better. Money matters, money challenges are going to improve and you will be coming into a more abundant time in your life. This could also be addressing relationships and that if you and or if you're in a relationship where you're committed that you guys have been struggling, things are about to change and um, you're definitely not gonna be struggling as much because life will find a way to make it more abundant heading into the future. 
All right, Geminis? So that's a great card to come in in relation to um, the answer that you've been waiting for. So things are definitely going to be getting better very soon, I'm feeling. Okay? And finally, the Law of Attraction card that came through for Geminis is, I understand the rules of the game of life. What it says on the back is, now that I understand the rules of this game of eternal life, now that I understand the powerful law of attraction and deliberate creation, I can pre-pave segment by segment my life experience into becoming the allower I was born to be, for I was destined to a life of fulfillment and never-ending joy. Indeed, we're all entitled to a life of fulfillment and never-ending joy. And all you need to do, Geminis, is to know that what you focus on, you can manifest as long as you truly believe in it. You have to have your whole heart into what it is that you want to create in your life. And yes, segment by segment, whatever it is that you focus on in your life, you can improve. You can find fulfillment in each area of your life that, is, that needs attention at this time. And you can have that never ending joy, but you just need to understand that you need to have positive thoughts in regard to each of those segments. If you truly believe that you can improve that area of your life, then focus on that and it will manifest. It will come to fruition, but you need to bring forth that energy that is needed in order for that area of your life to improve. Ultimately, it falls onto that law of attraction. What you intend to happen, what you focus on, will manifest. All right, Geminis? So that is the message that I have for you guys at this time in regard to these issues. I hope that it helped offer you guidance and clarity in regard to the issues and questions that you've had at this time. And I hope that that helped you in some way. Again, this is a general reading. It won't resonate with everyone. Um, so take from it what you will. And um, there you go. So again, if you need a personal reading, guys, I'm here for you. Please access all that information down below, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you, Geminis. Bye-bye.